सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द रिएक्ट नेटिव कोर्स इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी टॉक अबाउट द स्टेट इन प्रॉप्स इन क्लास कंपोनेंट इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट लाइफ साइकिल मेथड ऑफ कंपोनेंट इन रिएक्ट नेटिव सो लेट्स सी so you can see that everything like you know as if we talk about ourselves so we has a life cycle like you know first we born then we grow up and then we get older and after a certain amount of time we get died the same logic applies to the component okay so life cycle method of component react native so the component get mount on the ui then it will get updated and after that it will get unmount from the ui so let's see the some questions on the react native like what is life cycle in react native the phases of life cycle method and the when the life cycle will be executed okay so what is life cycle method in react native so everything has a life cycle let's suppose in the of there's in the component we have life cycle we have defined a life cycle like the component will mount the component will render on the ui the component will update on the ui and the component will remove from the ui so that is called life cycle so and that life cycle has some phases like as we have in the, our life some we have some phases called happier phases sorrow phases and money mood the same way uh, in the class com in a component we have some phases like mounting updating and unmounting mounting means like whatever we see on the screen that is called mounted or mounting updating means if there is something updating on the ui that is called updating phase unmounting means if the suppose whenever i click on back and the next so it what is happening the component is unmounting from the ui okay now the next question come up in our mind when life cycle will be executed okay so when component render first time that time life cycle method will be executed when we update the state that time a component life cycle will be executed when component update with props so let's suppose whenever we the props is value get updated so at that time of time life cycle method will be executed on error in a class component that time life cycle method will be executed and when the component get unmount means it will remove from the ui that time it will uh, life cycle method will be executed okay now let's talk about this in the last example like as we see that in the last example we have created a counter app right now we can see that uh, uh, so whenever first time what is happening so first time this you can see that text button all the things you know mounting on the ui right so that time which life cycle method will be executed that time uh, life cycle called mounting phase will be executed okay now when we click on uh, increment so it will incrementing that uh, value so it become uh, it will become update update phase and let's suppose it's if that component get removed from the ui due to some condition or like due to something else so that is called unmounting phase as simple as that i think that's all about the life cycle phase in react native let's make it simpler so it's if you want to go into deep dive you can deep dive into but yeah short form is that the mounting whenever the component mount on the ui updating the component get update and unmount it will get removed from the ui in the next video we are going to talk about the hooks in react native one of the most important topic of react native see you in the next video please let me know if you have guys any question and thank you bye